All right, the next slice of breaking news, more details about what's going to take place at the coordination meeting that's taking place right here in New Delhi at the residence of NCP President Sharad Pawar. We're learning, as my colleague Pallavi told us, that seat sharing is right on top of the agenda. But we're also learning that the TMC, and this is something Palvi was pointing out, that the TMC won't be sending a representative. Abhishek Banerjee was supposed to attend, but because he's been sent the ED notice, TMC won't be sending anyone else. Their hope is to put forth this point that their leaders are being witch-hunted. That issue will possibly also be discussed. This is all details that my colleague Pallavi did tell us. Let's go over to Pallavi for more context. Pallavi, you've also touched here on the Sanatan Dharm issue we've seen play out. Udhinidhi Stalin's comment and the furor after it. What is the plan to address this at the meeting today? So, uh, there was an official reaction which has come in from the Trinamool Congress yesterday. That was Derek O'Brien's quote when he says that there are 26 parties who are a part of the India front and we don't expect all of them to be photocopies of each other. So, it, I think there's a kind of a reluctant acceptance of the fact that, you know, this comment by Udhanidhi Stalin is something which we'll have to live with because this is what is important to DMK. It may not suit us. So the distancing has taken place. I mean, the Congress party very categorically has said that we believe in the, uh, uh, that the rights of everyone to practice their own religion and their religious beliefs. Similarly, Mamta Banerjee has said, I'm a Sanatani. So, you know, we have that. And the Amadi party yesterday also said that whatever a small party says does not really matter. So that distancing is very carefully has taken place because they want to cater to their constituency. But if we look at the larger picture of India front, I think at this point of time, they don't want this issue to be blowing up out of proportion because they know that this is only going to paint the India front as being not united. And at this point of time, apart from the seed sharing challenges, I think the big challenge is at least to put up this kind of a performance or a perception that the India front is uh, very much united despite the difference of opinion among some of them over key issues. Okay, Pallavi, thank you for bringing us that context. I'd also like to thank my colleague Shireen who joined us a little while earlier. Those are the details of the meeting that's taking place in just a few hours from now. The opposition parties of the INDIA alliance coming together to figure out that big question, how to share seats across the country. It's time for a short break. On the other side, more of the country's top stories. This is The Morning News Show.